Hello, hello. Day 24. 24 or 23? No. 23? <laughs> I think it's 24. <laughs> Good. So as you see, it's clear. First time that I'm leaving late. And today is 20 kilometers. That's one of the reasons that we are leaving late. Uh, from uh, Las Herrerías to from Fría. So the idea is to skip the... Not to skip, but today going uphill in the first part. And then we stay in the mountain. So good. Let's see how it goes. Okay, I forgot to mention that the first kilometers are up. I think we are going one kilometer and like a 200 meter high at 14% inclination or something. So today is going tough. It's going to be tough. Okay, I'm not uh, done with this uh, uphill today, but let me tell you about the wisdom of the Camino. <laughs> uh, this is Spanish actor, and I have heard it before. Uh, when I was working with him, was telling me that uh, if you come to El Camino with questions, you will be disappointed at the end because you will not find answers. He was saying that El Camino will give you what you need at that time <laughs> which sounds very stupid and esoteric <laughs> but that reminds me and another stupid and weird phrase that I, my mom always said that things happen for a reason and it's interesting <laughs> because again I'm a scientist I'm a logic guy and so on but I cannot deny that many important details in my life many important moments in my life had happened for a for a reason. <laughs> Things happen for a reason, and it's weird. And uh, of course, I had uh, many things in my mind to think about uh, my life in El Camino. <laughs> but I'm starting to think other stuff, and other things are happening. <laughs> Maybe they are for a reason. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I mean, it's life. You cannot predict it. You cannot uh, decide when to make decisions and when things happen in your life. And after 23 days, or 24, <laughs> I still don't remember. Uh, I think I totally agree with that. I agree with the wisdom of my mom and the wisdom of El Camino. It brings you what you need not what you ask and since now the road is becoming hard <laughs> I leave you here let's keep going uphill I think this is for me the second stage that is hard and I just want to have a picture of me Sweating as hell. This stuff. Let's do it. And this is when you said, Get up, son of a bitch. Because <laughs> Mickey loves you. <laughs> Shit. This stuff. <sighs> Okay, I think I reached the top of the mountain. Well, not the top of the mountain, but the highest city in the mountain. I need half an hour more, but I have to thank my lovely sticks. 50% of your weight should be in your sticks, and for sure it helped me. I just passed many people like nothing. <laughs> I, I must be stronger too. Good, let's keep walking.
So I'm still not done with the mountain, but uh, yeah, you saw already some uh, some videos from the drone. But the important thing today is that I enter in Galicia. <laughs> finally, <laughs> final, uh, final province of uh, Spain, province or region, whatever it's called. Yes. Okay, I'm first uh, town in Galicia, Osebreiro. Of course, I need to go to the church. <laughs> so, let's go. So, finally in Pomfria, and we have many nice uh, shots with the drone. It was nice, but it was too long. I think it's because uh, we start late. And my, uh, tomorrow maybe continue with the early thing. So now going into the hostel, and looks like a very small town, so maybe nothing else after this. <laughs> Good. Okay. <laughs> You're supposed to jump and then go up. Yes, and then what? <laughs> okay. Okay, and this is the end of day 24. <laughs> no, it's not 23, it's 24. I think it was good, the, the landscape was nice. Also the shots, I think they were really cool. The highlight is crossing Galicia. So I'm finally last couple of kilometers, although I don't, I'm not expecting, I'm not really uh, glad that I'm reaching the, the last part. And the jumping in the <laughs> that was really great. Good, this is the end of today. Hope you joined it, you like it, and see you tomorrow.